little Scottish history, and she has become my favorite. Her name was Black Agnes. Black Agnes, Countess of Dunbar, black hair, black temper too. Bade count goodbye with wave and sigh as he rode from her view. Her husband left within her care the castle and its key, its people and its policies, its gussies, kind and she, its piggies, cows, and ba <laughs> Lord Montague of Salisbury gathered up his men to mount to seek John Dunbar's walls. He took up ink and pen. Now show thy face, remove this place, and hand me o'er the keys. Or hear the tune of rock and ruin in British battery. Da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. Like Agnes knew her did true to people pride and place. As their prevent she must protect all those within her brains. Of Scottish king, I have my house, I pay him meat and fee. And I will keep my good old house if my house will keep me. Da da da, da 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 Salisbury's catapults rain down both shot and stone upon the walls of Dunbar Castle, shocking heart and moan. When all the weaponry had still surrender, loudly called. Like Agnes sent her waiting maids to dust the rampart wall. <laughs> From Salisbury's sieging tower there came a boring sound to batter the portcullis gates, gain English entry now. Like Agnes gathered up the stones that Salisbury had sent and flung them thrown to snatch the bones of pig with fierce intent. Da -da -da. No. Salisbury's strength thus failed, he then tried subterfuge to bribe a man within her clan to open the gates of love. The English foxes to descend upon the Scottish lands. He took their gold and boldly told Black Agnes of the plan. Da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. Plan thus failed, but the Countess, being thus informed, stood still. To spring a trap, the English watched the gates red high and scampered toward the gap. With Salisbury in the front, one dumb grunt ran before. Down <coughs> came the gate to separate the soldier from his lord. Dum, 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 dum. The plan was still black and frail. Dear Montague, farewell. It was my design that you should dine within my dungeon bell. Help me as you have before to thwart the English crown. Ah, thus be your fate, I chicken mate. You'll never bring Dunbar down. <laughs> Salisbury rail behind the safety of his men. One Scottish crown well nigh alone will not skirt me again. Do -de -de -do -de -de -do -de -de. A bowman on the Dunbar ramparts drew and loose to dirt. Killed the man he said it to, like Agnes pierced the heart. Five months sieging, Salisbury tried to rest so dire. I'll hang your brother from me, Jim, if you do not retire. Ha! Hang him, laughed Black Agnes. It'll only be only plan. I am his heir, inheriting his titles and his lands. Do do they didn't hang him. Do 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 do. One hundred forty-eight day siege cost nine six thousand pounds. That would be eleven million seven hundred ninety-eight thousand three hundred and twenty-six pounds seventy-six pence in today's. Yeah. On June 10th, 1338, the English left the ground. They did not count on Scottish fortitude on Scottish field. They did not count Black Agnes as a foe who would not yield. Black Agnes knew her duty true to people, pride, and place. As their prefect, I must protect all those within my grace. From 
one Scottish king, I had my hopes, I pay him me ten fee, and I will keep my good old hopes, if my hopes 